Hello, X-Men Legacy here, and today I'm going to show you guys how to romance Judy as a male version of V. To do so, you're going to need a PC, and you're going to need a mod that allows console commands. So, to do that, you're going to need to head over to the Nexus Mods Cyberpunk 2077 page for the Cyber Engine Tweaks. This will allow a cheat console to be enabled. So, I'll have a link to this in the description. You're just going to need to hit files here and then manual download. Once it's downloaded, just click on it. It'll open up this and I'll show you where to put all that in a second. Next thing you're going to need, you're going to need this right here. You'll need to go to find Romance Judy for Male V. You can either download it or you can just copy this right here. And you'll see why in a bit. This is the console command we're going to need to make Judy romanceable inside of Cyberpunk 2077. Now, let's minimize this. Now you just need to find where your Cyberpunk 2077 is located. For me, it's on my second drive. Let's open this here. Go to GOG Galaxy. Cyberpunk 2077 bin x64. Now, once you have X64 open, you just copy all of these files here and drag it over. Now, if you opted to downloading the Judy file, you just need to drag the file you download into this folder here. It's going to be under plugins, cyber tweaks, scripts, and then right here. Okay. Now that you've done that, you can just minimize all this, start up the game, and progress through Judy's storyline. Once you're on the final side quest for Judy Alvarez, uh, it'll be called Pyramid Song. Right after you have nearly drowned, Judy will pull you out of the water, and then she'll ask you what kind of coffee you want. Take your coffee, doesn't matter what one. When she tries to do the coffee, the power is going to go off. You I go turn the generator back on. And that is where you enter the command that we copied previously. Once you get to the generator, just start generator. Then you press the tilde button. And then put in the command, which is game.setDebugFact. Parentheses, forward quote, Judy underscore, romanceable, and quote, comma one, parentheses. Once you've entered that, you just walk back up into the cottage and knock on the door. What was that? Couldn't hear you clearly. Something the matter? No, nothing. You'll know you've done it correctly. When she starts talking about it being your day, and you get the option to touch. And there's going to be a little kissy face and stuff next to it. So, there it is. Just wanted to be our day, and then there it is. Touch. It is ours. And this is where it initiates the romance scene. Now, if you guys like this tutorial, please leave a like, a comment, and subscribe. I'll leave a link in the description for the uncensored version of the scene. So that if you guys don't really want to go through the trouble of doing the whole thing, you guys can just watch it below. Bye, guys.